Fairfax. And I'm Tasha Thompson. And welcome to Cabiras this week. And this week we're at Clearwater Artist Studios in Concord. And a great exhibit here. Tasha's going to tell you all about that and a lot of other things going on here. Lots of information on today's show. So grab that pen and paper, write that contact info down. But if you miss something, don't worry about it. Just go to cabiriscounty.us slash on CTW. All the contact info is right there. Today, CTW visits Clearwater Artist Studios in Concord for the exhibition of guest artist Philip Larimore. Once home to Concord Waterworks, the city of Concord renovated the space with the goal of having an artisan village that strengthens the surrounding neighborhoods. Following that vision, Clearwater Artist Studios currently hosts 16 artists in residence who create and display artwork in a variety of media, including fine art, pastel, oil, and acrylic painting, stained glass, clay, pottery, turned wood, mosaic, and other hand-tooled leathers. Laramore's exhibition, The Go-Between, as the title alludes, goes between painting and sculpting and between abstraction and realism. The exhibition is his largest collection of works shown in the past 15 years and includes pieces from 1999 to present day. He creates a visionary fantasia based on da Vinci's deluge drawings through painting composed on three to six layers of aluminum screening. Laramore also includes shadow casters, which use shadow and shape to give the pieces, which consist of malleable aluminum screening, a sculptural hologram-like appearance. A third category, observatories, consists of boxes within boxes of the same painted screening. You can visit with Laramore as he presents his perspectives on the exhibition and his career at his artist talk at the Clearwater Artist Studios on Saturday, June 11th at 2 p.m. That's also Clearwater's monthly second Saturday Open Studios Day. So the other art studios are open from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. as well. A $5 donation is suggested. The studios are located within Concord's Gibson Village at 223 Crowell Drive, Northwest, just off Kerr Street. Through June 30th, you can view the Laramore Exhibition Tuesdays through Fridays, noon to 5 p.m., with special evening hours until 7 p.m. on most Tuesdays. For more information on Philip Laramore's exhibition, The Go-Between, and other events at Clearwater Artist Studios, or to learn how you can volunteer at the studios, visit clearwaterartists.com, see their Facebook page, or call 704-784-9535. Now, do you have a budding artist at home? Well, sign them up for the youth art classes at Clearwater this summer. Various types of classes are offered at each age group. You've got the Tiny Tots Camp, introduce <laughs> kids ages three to five to arts and crafts, and kapow! Okay, oh. there we go. We got comics and cartoon characters. Nah, that's they're going to teach the kids. Oh, I'd like to come to that. Uh -huh. Okay, ages ten to fourteen, body and facial proportions to sketch their own comic heroes and villains. Of course, there's just a small sample of the awesome art classes this summer at Clearwater. So for more information on youth art summer classes, Clearwater Artist Studio, just visit Concord Park and Rec or just call 704-920-5600. How long can you stay on? Harris <laughs> County is hosting the only log rolling class in the area and now is your chance to give it a try. That's right, log rolling. <laughs> yes. You can sign up now for one of two six session classes that begin on June 13th and July 11th at Camp T and Spencer Park. The classes are Mondays and Fridays, 4 to 5 p.m. Maybe you can get out a little early from work. Ah. Learn log rolling basics, drills, skills, and games. Mm. Appropriate for ages eight and older, log rolling is a great fitness challenge and it's a lot of fun, right, David? Oh, absolutely. Thanks to innovative equipment that makes the sport easily accessible, the water sport is growing in popularity across recreational programs throughout the country. The six session class costs $30. For more information on log rolling classes at Camp TN Spencer Park, visit cabarrascounty.us slash register or call 704-920-3484. Okay, now come on for an adventure with the staff at the Frank List Park for Bugs and Beasties. Okay, that's a half-day camp on June 21st through the 23rd from 9 to 11 a.m. Now, kids ages 4 to 7 discover the world around them by kind of catching and learning all sorts about the resident insects and other creatures they may stumble upon. Now, this half-day camp is a perfect way to introduce little ones to their natural world. Cost is only $15, and hey, that includes snack. Mm -hmm. 
For more information on Bugs and Beasties, June 21st to the 23rd from 9 to 11 a.m. Franklin's Park, just visit cabarrascounty.us slash register or call 704-920-3484. Do you have a health condition like diabetes, mm. arthritis, or chronic pain? Does your health condition prevent you from doing things you love? The Living Healthy Workshop Tuesdays beginning June 14th, 9.30 a.m. to noon at the Kannapolis Branch of the Library is a free six-week series that helps you take charge of your life. You'll get the support you need while finding practical ways to deal with pain and fatigue. Mm. Participants discover better nutrition and exercise choices. They understand new treatment options and learn better ways to talk with your doctor and family. Oh, that's very important great, yes. about your health. For more information on the Living Healthy six week seminar, Tuesdays beginning June 14th at the Kannapolis branch of the library, visit cabarrascounty.us slash on CTW or call 704 920 1180. Now, there's nothing simple about how a salad tastes. But salads are pretty simple to make. Cabarrus Health Alliance is going to help you expand your healthy cooking skills at the Simple Salad Cooking Class. That's going to happen on Friday, June the 17th at 11 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. Classes are open to everyone and kids five and older. They're welcome to come if, you know, if they're accompanied by a guardian, of course. Mm -hmm. Now, the class only costs $10 per person and registration and payment is required in advance. So for more information or to register for a Simple Salad Cooking Class, Cabarrus Health Alliance on June 17th from 11 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. Just visit at CabarrasHealth.org or call 704-920-1303. Books, bikes, and baseball game, right? It's yeah. a great way to kick off the 2016 Summer Reading Program. The Bike Rodeo is Saturday, June 11th from 3 to 5 p.m. and that's at Kannapolis and Tenement Dater Stadium. Bring your bike and your helmet to the stadium to brush up on the rules of the road, bike decoration, and tips for safe riding. After the rodeo, the first 100 kids get into the baseball game for free. That's pretty awesome. The summer <laughs> reading program is open to all county residents. Just pick up a reading log at any branch of the library. You can qualify for a prize by logging hours spent reading. For more information about the summer reading program, visit cabarruscounty.us slash library or call 704-920-2050. Now, how about an app sampler? my favorite kind of dinner. Thank you. No, 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 no. Oh, We're not no. talking about food. We're talking about library apps. Oh. oh, okay. Now, Mount Pleasant Branch of the Library serves up App Sampler on Wednesday, June the 8th at noon. Now, this class shows participants how to download library apps so you can read everything from magazines to ebooks, even learn a new language. That'd Very be good. Cool. Now, the classes and apps and down free, downloads are free. That's good if you have a library card. Now bring your fully charged smart device. For more information on the app sampler on June the 8th at noon at Mount Pleasant Branch, just visit cabarruscounty.us slash on CTW or call 704-920-2202. You know, our last Government 101 class, we had a little section where the library folks came in and taught people oh, yes. how to use their devices and how to connect with the library. In an hour, people were filled with knowledge about oh, how to wow. use their device and get free magazines and play games, all kinds of stuff. It's so really encourage that class. Absolutely. Now, a diet filled with a variety of colors isn't only healthy, it's also fun. Hmm, Kids ages five to eight explore nutritious and easy to prepare snack and foods during Eat the Rainbow Camp. June 15th <laughs> and 16th, 9 a.m. to noon. That's at the Cooperative Extension office. This healthy eating camp also teaches kitchen safety in a fun, colorful environment. The camp is only $30. For more information on Eat the Rainbow Camp, June 15th and 16th, 9 a.m. to noon at Cooperative Extension, visit cabarruscounty.us slash register or call 704-920-1303. Now, what would a super-powered Olympics look like? What do you think? It would be fast and loud. <laughs> This is true. Just like a race. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, how would you play basketball in zero-G environment? Like Space Jam? Yeah, it would be, that's exactly what I was thinking. Mm -hmm. Now, come imagine and write about your own super sports character at the fantastic 
testicle sports and how to play them on Friday, June the 10th, 4 p.m., the Concord branch of the library. Now, the laws of physics don't exist for these made-up athletes. Mm -hmm. hey, it's totally your imagination. And I can see an undefeated season coming into this future. That's right. Uh, so for more information on the fantastical sports and how to play them on June the 10th at 4 p.m. at the Concord branch of the library, visit cabarriscounty.us slash on CTW or call 704-920-2050. There's no question our Cabarrus County seniors have talent. Oh, absolutely. Did you see the Follies? Yes. Fantastic. Now's your chance to top that performance at the Talent Show, Wednesday, June 15th at 1230 p.m. That's at the Cabarrus County Senior Center right here in Concord. Participants must sign up by June 10th. For more information on the Talent Show, June 15th, 1230 p.m. at the Senior Center in Concord, visit cabarruscounty.us slash on CTW or call 704. 9203484 Now you don't want to pass off your non-green thumb to your kids. No. No, no, no. You know, I got to sign them up for the Cooperative Extension Garden Camp. That's June 14th through the 16th, 9 a.m. till noon. Now these kid farmers ages 9 to 14 meet at the LMC Lomax Farm in the morning to explore local foods, all kinds of gardening, basics and landscaping. The cost is only thirty dollars. That is a deal. Because mm -hmm. our deal when we were kids was get out there and work on the farm. <laughs> That's and oh, true. by the way, if you do, you'll have something to eat. eat there, I know. <laughs> so now, but hey, you know, it kind of goes down Life the line changes. because well, for this thirty dollars, you get snacks and oh. equipment and activities are already included. Fantastic. One other thing. What's that? Now that all my my children are out of the house because mm -hmm. we had trained them to plant flowers and to do gardening stuff, mm -hmm. guess who ends up doing it now? So see, this is a great way to train your kids and have gardeners for a long time. No, I got a little gardener. She, there you go, see, getting pulling started. all the dirt out of every single planter. <laughs> it's fantastic. That's great. So for more information or to register for the garden camp on June 14th and 16th at 9 a.m. till noon, the Elma C. Lomax Farm, just visit cabarruscounty.us slash register or call 704-920-1303. Canning produce when your gardens are overproducing, when your kids are too effective in their gardening <laughs> skills, it. is a great way to save money on groceries and enjoy your favorite foods out of season. With a few easy lessons, you can pick up the basics of canning safety methods for both water bath and mm. pressure canners. Okay. The Cooperative Extension is ready to get you on the way to stocking your pantry during the basics of home canning. Two class times are available Wednesday, June 8th, 9.30 to 1.30 or Thursday, June 9th, 5.30 to 9.30 p.m. The class is for beginners, but it's also a great refresher for oh, experienced yes. canners and only costs $22 per person. All supplies and equipment are provided. Participants may also test their personal pressure canner dial gauge at the class. That's a good thing to you do. You know, I've got mine in the back pocket. <laughs> for more information or to register for the basics of home canning class, June 8th, 9.30 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. or June 9th, 5.30 to 9.30 p.m. at the Cooperative Extension Office, visit cabarruscounty.us slash register or call 704-920-3310. Now, one man's junk is another man's treasure. Now, you can make some money off these treasures at the Cabarrus County Senior Center in Concord for their yard sale. That's on Saturday, June 18th at 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. Now, reserve your booth for only $20. So, for more information on the yard sale, June 18th, 8 a.m. to 2 p.m., Cabarrus County Senior Center in Concord, visit cabarruscounty.us slash on CTW or call 704-920-3484. Now, I know we've got a lot of information on today's show, so if you missed any of that contact information, like we said at the top of the show, all you got to do is go to cabarruscounty.us slash on CTW and you get all your contact info. And sign up for our newsletter. It's so easy. Just text CTW to 22828 or go to cabarruscounty.us on the top right side of the page. Click newsletter sign up. It all comes to you. And we want you to follow us on Facebook and Twitter. So many people do. It's a great way to get just the right amount of information from the county. And if you have family and friends who don't have Time Warner Cable, can't watch us on Channel 22, or maybe you just want to watch us when you get a chance, well, just go to cabarruscounty.us slash Cabco TV, and up comes the media page. Got all the different shows on there, and all kinds of good stuff going on, so you got to check it all out. And I, and I tell you, speaking of checking out, 
Mm. Got to check out this new exhibit. I mean, I love the dimensional aspect of it. It's really something you have to see in person oh, and do. experience. Every angle has a different look. light, yeah. different look, different texture look. look. Walking around mm -hmm. kind of staring. It's really cool. <laughs> and until next week, you have a great one. Take care.